Lobsters were once considered the poor man's chicken because they were so plentiful and cheap. But not every lobster that's caught is eaten, including these next two. In today's episode of Unusual as Usual, we're learning about Harley Quinn and Santa Claus, two very curious crustaceans. <laughs> Harley Quinn is a lobster that was caught off the coast of Bridlington, England in 2010. He is believed to have been around five to six years old when he was caught. What makes him particularly unique is his unusual colour. His colours are split in half. On one side is bright orange, the other side dark blue. Much like a human skin, the shell of a lobster has its colour determined by how prominent certain pigments are. In humans, it's called melanin. In lobsters, it's a pigment called astaxanthin. Two-toned lobsters are often called split or chimera lobsters, named after the Greek mythological beast. The chimera is supposedly a monstrous creature made of more than one animal, usually depicted as a lion with the head of a goat protruding from its back and a tail that ends with a snake's head. Oh, and don't forget, the goat can breathe fire. Go figure. Essentially, the chimera is thought to be a single organism that's made up of cells from two or more individuals. Harley Quinn was named after the fictional character and love interest of the Joker in the Batman animated series. Her bizarre red and black appearance is reminiscent of a medieval jester. As rare as split lobsters are, enough of them have been caught to see that usually one side will be one colour and the other side will be another, separated by a near perfect straight line the entire way down the body. However, in Harley Quinn's case, the body is split down the middle and the claws and tail are split the opposite way around, giving him his unique checkered jester appearance. The fisherman that caught him judged him too unique to be served up as a seafood dish and instead brought him to the Scarborough Sea Life Center Marine life specialist Amy McFarlane said, he's such a striking individual. He did extremely well to avoid predators like conger eels and seals when he was in the open sea. And now he's safe from predators, he could live for a further 60 or 70 years. Scarborough Sea Life Center spokesman, Tob German said, blue, red and yellow lobsters have all been found, but this one is the strangest anyone has ever heard of with one side black and the other side dull red. And that's before you mention his claws. He went on to say, the odds of finding a split lobster are one in 50 million. But I couldn't tell you what the odds would be of finding one as unique as Harley Quinn. When Harley Quinn came to stay at the Scarborough Sea Life Center, they contacted the National Lobster Hatchery in Cornwall. And they said they had never seen one like him before. The crustacean is being kept in a display tank at the center's weird and wonderful exhibition. And since arriving, he has shed his shell twice, which have been carefully preserved and are on display close to his tank. But Harley Quinn isn't the only unique lobster that's been found in the UK. Santa Claus is a lobster that was caught off the coast of Portland Bill, Dorset, in December 2011. Instead of being two-toned, he was actually born with no pigment at all, making him an albino lobster. He is completely white from the tips of his claws to the end of his tail, with only his eyes black. Santa Claus is believed to be 30 years old when he was caught, which is remarkable as the lack of pigment in albino animals makes them far more likely to be targeted by predators as they do not blend into their natural surroundings. Albino lobsters have a genetic condition which leaves them with no pigment in their shells. Unlike other rare blue or yellow colored lobsters, albino lobsters will not turn red when boiled because of their lack of pigment. When he was caught, rather than cooking him for tea, the fisherman brought him to the Weymouth Sea Life Park where he was named and given permanent residence. Weymouth Sea Life Park's curator, Fiona Smith, said there have been one or two other albino lobsters found in the UK in the last 20 years or so, but none of them as perfect as Santa. 
Santa Claus lives in an outdoor rock pool feature and since arriving at the park has shed his shell once, leaving it perfectly preserved to be on display and amaze visitors. And there we have it, Harley Quinn, the checkered lobster and Santa Claus, the albino lobster. What do you think? Were they cute or creepy? Let me know in the comment section below and as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. That's all we've got time for today, but I'll see you all next week. And remember, stay unusual as usual. You can check out the most recent video by clicking here. And if you click here, you'll see the video that YouTube thinks you should be watching next. Don't forget to ring that bell to make sure you don't miss out on next week's video. And if you have any ideas on what the next episode should be about, make sure you add it to the comment section below.